Hey guys, it's Liz and we're flipping things and I'm trying something new today. It's kind of trying something new that I've sort of tried before. I have ordered, I just got it, a giant box from bulk.com. But this box I actually ordered through eBay and it's apparently one of those boxes where um, the listings are like basically done. You've just got a photograph and everything's already done for you. You can just post it to eBay or, or that's how they advertise it. So let's see what's in the box and see if we can figure this all out. All right. Welcome back guys. Um, okay. So I have ordered from bulk before. Um, some of you may have seen the video. I ordered uninspected returns last time and I ordered them directly from bulk.com. I was not thrilled. Um, it wasn't the worst thing I've ever purchased, but the condition of some of the items was like, like some stuff had to be thrown out. I mean, that's just the truth. Like, you know, but I had said I wanted to give bulk another chance and try their new items, like which would I guess would be shelf pulls and things like that. Um, and I'd been hearing for a couple of months that bulk was actually selling manifested boxes through eBay. And somehow through that manifest, the eBay listing is apparently already sort of completed for you, like with details, I think. Um, and so I, my understanding is you've just got to photograph the item, drop it into these pre-made listings and it's up on eBay. It sounds too good to be true, but I decided to give it a shot. Um, so this box and it just arrived and I'll tell you today is March 18th. I ordered this on March 15th. I couldn't believe how fast it got here. It came from Tennessee to New York. It shipped out on the 16th and it was here on the 18th. Very fast. Um, it's very big. It is 26 pounds. Um, and it is sporting goods. Now, they are supposed to be new. I'm looking at the details right now um, just to give you guys the right information. So it, according to the listing, the original retail for everything in this box was $596.07. Now, that's a tough one to go by. I don't know. I It's so easily inflated um, that I, I don't really want to, you know... I don't know. That's what the original retail was. Um, part of the reason I picked this box was because it is mostly, it's sporting goods, but it's mostly camping sporting goods and things that I know if there's an issue, if it's not perfect. Um, I have three boys. We camp a lot. They play, they are outside from the minute the weather turns and it's nice enough to be outside, they're outside doing some sort of sport. So I figured worst thing that could happen is some of the stuff could go to them. So the box was $99 um, and shipping was $30. So, and then there was taxes. Hold on, let me go back and double check my total price. Um, yeah, it was $99 plus $30 shipping, which was standard shipping. And again, it shipped out like same day or first thing the next morning um, and was here in no time. Like I was really impressed. So I mean, let's dig in and see. Here's what I'm thinking. I think I'm going to unbox it today and we'll take a look at what's in here and what kind of condition this stuff is in because my last box was not great. Um, and then I will do a second video where I'm actually trying to see how this whole system works with taking these items and getting them listed on eBay without a problem. Um, I think most resellers are similar to me in that the real issue is getting things listed. We're all really good at sourcing, <laughs> but, but then suddenly um, there's a whole lot of sourced items and not much in terms of things listed. And um, so anything that's going to cut down on my listing time to me is pretty positive and I am all about it. So I'm really hopeful that that is the case with this. Um, I will say these bulk boxes are like with the handles, they're, they got the good boxes, that's for sure. Um, all right, let's see, maybe, 
I guess I could have done better on cutting that. <laughs> uh, okay. All right. Already looks better than my last box. I don't know if you guys can see. Let me see if I can. So it's not filled to the top, although I didn't necessarily expect it to be. It's not like one of those mystery boxes where your expectation is, is that it's filled to the top. It's filled with what's in the manifest. Um, there were some items that I couldn't look up and I know there's some that have multiples that I think I can do okay on. So let's just pull out the first item. Um, so this is a Camelback, just water bottle. This is pristine condition is excellent. It's definitely brand new. Um, could I sell this? Absolutely. Do my kids use these, um, on a daily basis? Yes. So I might, I might keep it. See, maybe I shouldn't be ordering things that I, I want to keep. So this is great. This is in fine condition. I am really happy already. Next, we'll just pull out this big thing. This is a flying saucer shootout. Um, oh. So it looks like some things, some shoot the flying saucer out of the sky hit a moving target as it hovers up and down and it's got an infrared blaster hovering flying saucer led sensors a whole bunch of stuff so just pretend that didn't happen three hits to take it down this is a cool item and i actually didn't even notice this on the manifest or if i did i didn't realize what it was um we have an infant bike helmet super cute Definitely new and never used. Um, I'm really, really happy with the quality on these items. Um, oh, one thing I wanted to mention and I forgot. On this one, um, the cost per item is $2.76. So there was 40, there should be 42 items in here. And that comes out to $2.76. And that's with shipping, I believe. Um, so this is totally nice. This is an easy sell, especially with summer coming up. We have a therapy kit, hot and cold therapy kit to soothe sore muscles and reduce tightness. I mean, this is cute. Um, it does have like the regular barcode, so I can scan that and check it out. Um, I know there's a lot of these. I remember this from the manifest. So this is a youth poncho, one size fits most. I can't remember exactly how many there are, but there's a bunch of these. Um, and when I looked them up on eBay, they're selling for anywhere from like eight to ten dollars each. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and eleven. I think there's sixteen if I remember right. That's eleven. Twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16. Yeah, I was right. Oh my God. Maybe because it wasn't that long ago that I looked at the manifest. Um, but these are great. So they, it does look like they were on clearance. They were originally uh, listed at $12.99 and then they went on clearance to $3.89. I hope you guys can see that. Great there. Um, but they are in... I mean, brand new, unused condition. These are great. I don't know. I mean, where we live, we're coming into spring and it rains for what feels like months. Um, let's see what else is in here. So this is a Camelback bottle, bite valve, and straw. Um, so this is just one of those replacement pieces for a Camelback um, and it does have a regular UPC so I'm able to look that up. So this has one straw and two of the caps. I think people are definitely looking for these. That's a, that's a good sell. I'm really, guys, I'm really happy with this box. Like, oh, here is another Camelback water bottle. The first one was in blue. This one is in gray. Um, I mean, awesome. We'll pull out another big thing. Oh, this one's heavy. All right, this is Perfect Push Up Elite. I think this was actually the highest um, dollar amount in the box. This is those like, I, I, I mean, 
those are things I don't do. But I should. I should do those things. I I just don't. Um, perfect push-up elite. I can't remember what this one was going for, but this is a good item. Um, I shouldn't have any trouble selling it. I feel great about that. We have some table tennis balls or ping pong balls. I'll be honest with you. And they, and they are Franklin, um, the brand Franklin, which is... My kids are probably going to steal these. I don't know about you guys. Like, my kids do the... the they, they bounce the balls all over the place and into a cup. It's a YouTube thing, I guess. Uh, or TikTok. Um, all right, so here we have a Coleman mini flashlight, and it comes with batteries. This was originally $11.99. It was marked down on clearance to $3.59. Um... But I mean, listen, Coleman's a great brand. And again, perfectly beautiful condition. I'm so, so excited about this box. Here's another one. This one is a, oh, these are both Coleman kids. So here's another mini flashlight. This one's in blue. Um, and same same price. It got marked down to $3.59 from $11.99. Um, but we're coming into camping season. So when I saw this box, I was like, this feels like all the things. So here is another Coleman item. We use a lot of Coleman when we camp. This is an Adventure Lantern Coleman Kids. It's not working, but it's probably, I'm sure it doesn't have batteries in there. Um, but it's just a little cute little lantern. Um, another Coleman Kids. This is a mini, mini head, headlamp and it does come with the batteries. Uh, you can see it, great item. This is a Schwinn quick light. Oh, I think the, oh, it says try me. Whoa, whoa. Um, so these go on like your bike. Um, I will probably keep those because my boys don't have head, headlights on their bikes. Here's another Coleman kids mini flashlight. Again, is this the same? Yeah. So this is also in blue. I love these because you can do one listing with multiple items. Um, all right, this is a Saber Personal Runner Series. You know what this is? This is for runners. It's an alarm. It's an alarm you can basically, I don't, oh, it requires batteries. Um, it calls for help. It's clips to your clothing, maximum visibility. Basically, it is um, if you're out running and you're attacked. There's someone out there that wants that. Here's another um, one of the kids' flashlights. Okay, so on these alarms, we've got several of these. Let's see them right here. Hmm. We have two more of the kids' flashlights, one in red and one in orange. Um say um so much you guys this i did not see on the manifest but it's just some vinyl stickers um which my kids will probably beg for we've got a brita water filter uh it is in new condition we have a Coleman dry gear bag. I love the Coleman stuff. I'm like really excited. And then our last item is, oh, one more of these alarms. So I'll be honest, I'm thrilled with this box. I am absolutely thrilled with this box. Now, what I don't know is how this whole getting it listed on eBay works. I'm gonna look into that. But I am quickly going to just go in and total up the amounts um, so I can tell you guys, here's what I paid. Here's what I stand to make. Um, but listen, this was here super fast and I feel like I hit the jackpot. Like, I'm so happy I don't even know what to say. So let me just total everything up and then I'll come right back and we'll see if I... I'm, I'm rightfully happy or not. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm shocked. Like, I'm shocked. 
I'll be honest, my first experience with bulk was uninspected returns. It did leave me with like mixed emotions. Um, like I did okay, but a lot of that stuff, like I've got to sell it for significantly less because it's used basically, right? It was uninspected returns and the stuff was used if it was working. This is like a completely different world. Now, I don't know. I have not ordered from bulk.com from the website or from the app new items if everything new is like this kind of quality but i can tell you ordering from bulk.com through ebay is one super fast and in, i am so impressed with the quality every item is in perfect condition um and literally sellable right now and there are some slow movers on here. The ponchos, I think, are going to be slow movers. I'm probably going to put those up on Facebook Marketplace as well. So there are some items that are going to be slow to move. But here's the thing. I bought the box for $100, $99.99, plus $30 shipping. When I just added up the profit, well, the revenue. So here's what I think. The, the revenue I can make is $471. $60 for those personal alarms, $72 for the kids' flashlights, that's for all six of them total, would be $72. The ponchos, if I sell all 16 at just $10, um, which is actually under what people are asking, $160. $25 for that flying saucer shootout, um, $13 for the Coleman dry sack, the Brita filters, $10, and most of these are very low estimates. Um, $7 for the replacement straws for the camelbacks, the actual camelbacks themselves. I just priced low at eight for $16. The table tennis balls, 15 bucks. What? I don't know. I go, I go buy those at Walmart for like a couple bucks. So I was pretty surprised. Um, the perfect push up $30, the Schwinn little infant head helmet, head, head protector helmet. Um, $20. I just jumped around and I lost my place. The mini headlight for the Coleman mini headlight is $10. The Coleman mini lantern, $10. Um, I mean, I'm thrilled. I am like, this is, I think what like professional sorcerers do. And we all know I'm not a professional. I am, I am just winging it. I am just learning as I go. But like, this is amazing. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Um, I'm really glad because I haven't done any sort of like sporting goods. Though a, a, a box a few weeks ago, I got a bunch of like the exercise bands and I was like, wow, I hadn't really thought about sporting goods. Um, but especially as we're coming into like spring and summer and camping season, like the timing couldn't be better for this. I don't know how I got so lucky to find this and, and grab it. Um, but I'm super thrilled. So I, this video is running kind of long. So what I'm going to do is I'll probably end it here and be like, yes, try bulk through eBay because wow, wow. Um, and the manifests are all on there. And then I will do a second video where I actually am seeing how this whole draft listing works. Um, I've heard like the titles, you've got to fix the titles and sometimes the categories are off a bit. But even if it gives me a draft for each item and I can just go in there and make my edits, that's a million times better. So I am going to pull everything out, photograph it, and then I will do a second video um, seeing how that system works. Because if it really does help with the listings, well, now you've got like amazing quality products plus time cut off from actually listing the stuff on eBay. And that to me is like a triple when what's that what what's <laughs> the triple crown i was like what's it the horses you know the horses the kentucky derby the preakness the, the triple crown this is like the triple crown if this is the actual quality of products all the time when you get new manifested lots on ebay and it starts the listings for you so that you've just got to finish it edit it and post it like this might be all I do from now on. I'm like so happy. I'm so happy. All right. I hope you guys are having a beautiful day. I am having a beautiful day now. 
Um, in other news, I finally got those 72. I'm looking at them right now because they're still over there because I was scanning UPC codes. I finally got the 72 um, members mark golf polos listed to eBay last night. It took me a long time. It was the first time I had done variations where basically I have one listing that has 20 variations. So there's five different colors in four sizes for each color, medium, large, extra large, and 2XL. Um, and it took a while to figure out, but I was really happy I figured it out because now I've just got one listing where someone can just go in and basically choose, I want this color in this size, um, all the same price. I'm really happy. I don't know. Um, I thought it was, once I figured it out, it was pretty easy to do. I did have to actually go in and like search Google and look a few things up because I was having some trouble. But if you guys are interested in how I did that, if anyone's interested in doing like um, listings with variations in terms of size or color or anything, let me know. I can make a video on it. I should have done it last night, but I was frustrated. Um, so I got it done though. They're listed. I'm really excited. Um, I am going to get these photographed. I'm so excited. I'm so happy. I'm so happy, you guys. I hope you guys are having a beautiful day. We're almost to the weekend, which I'm pretty excited about. Um, I will get this done. I will make the next video. And thank you for watching. I appreciate all of you. Feel free, please, to like, comment, subscribe, whatever you'd like to do. Um, you don't have to, though. No pressure. And have a beautiful day. Thanks for watching, guys.